tell us more about our inventory of fundamental particles. We know about 17 particles in total at the moment. So there are the six quarks that we've already talked about. Then there's the electron, which goes around the atom. And the electron also comes in this triplet. There are three electron-like particles. The next one's called the muon and then something called a tau. And then there are three neutrinos, these like ghostly particles that zip through the universe and through us and we don't really notice most of the time. That in itself is a mystery because they come in these like three copies, these what we call the generations, and we don't know why. It's very mysterious. So it's kind of like we have these Lego bricks in our set, but we don't understand why we have these particular pieces. And then there are the forces. So there are three forces in our kind of quantum description of the world. We don't include gravity. We don't know how to deal with that yet. But we've got the electromagnetic force, the weak force, and the strong force. And they each have particles. So 16 in total. And then the last one, which was found about a decade ago at the LHC, which is the Higgs boson. So that kind of finishes off our 17 particles in what we call the standard model. But we don't think that's the end of the story for lots of reasons, mostly to do with astronomy, actually, thanks to you know you and your colleagues discovering this inconvenient stuff out there in the universe called dark matter. So that suggests there must be more stuff that we, we haven't found yet. 